All righty. Foss Market is a Covington staple. Cool. Seven ninety five. Very much. You're very welcome. It's been here in one form or another since 1927. The feed that kind of went away with the farms. Elements of its history are spread around as if for a scavenger hunt that'll never happen. You have to dial the number out. Carla Holmes uses some of that history every day. And it talks, it transmits. She's worked here 16 years, was born and raised in Covington, and has seen it all change. Farms went away, so it wasn't real good business. 6,000 people have moved here since Covington became a city in 1997. We grow anywhere from two, three, four hundred uh, new people every year. Richard Hart is Covington's community development director. There's a new hospital here, new apartment buildings, homes, and big box stores. It's happening fast. And the people at those jobs just cannot afford the high cost of housing, especially family housing. Covington works with the Puget Sound Regional Council, a group of governments that monitor growth. PSRC says Covington is small, but in order for the city to keep growing and get federal transportation money, it needs PSRC to classify it as bigger, a larger city. And once you become that, PSRC then is more acceptable of you growing and growing at a faster rate. This piece of property here is being developed. The city already knows where it will expand. Some of the new ones that have been added out in this area. Out of 20. Holmes remembers how it used to be. Getting bigger, she doesn't seem to mind. Yeah, you betcha. I can't say it's a bad thing. It's just a thing. There you go, hon. In Covington, John Langler. You have a fabulous evening. King 5 News. See ya.